Hey guys, welcome to the video. Haseeb here and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to talk about Go Collab. I'm very excited because I've been waiting for this forever. If you don't know what Go Collab is, just watch the entire video. Make sure you watch the whole thing. If you know what school is, SKOOL dot com, it's a platform that allows you to host your own group, just like a Facebook group where you add members. So you grow your audience base and you can sell your product or services to that audience. School basically makes the process really efficient. Now, what, what Go Collab is, it's very close to school. So it's a worthy opponent. I would say that. And it's created by Go High Level, if I'm not wrong. Anyway, it allows you to host a free community instead of, you know, if you if you use school, you have to pay $99 a month for each group. So let's say you have three groups, you have to pay $99 per month for each, right? And that's in school. You know, Alex Ramosi bought school and then they took it to the next level. They have a bunch of stuff going on there. They're, in, uh, they're doing the school games and all those things. That's when Go High Level brought Go Collab to us. Now, what's exclusive for us who are using Go High Level? Because we, I know that uh, a lot of us are already using the community feature in Go High Level. So if we go to our Go High Level account, go to memberships, go to communities, groups, we can host our own groups in it. We can add members to it. Um, and then we can also start, you know, making the group paid. We can add courses to the, to the community and we can, you know, do a bunch of stuff with it. Now, after Go Collab is introduced, we can make our group public now because before Go Collab was even a thing, we just hosted this group there and then we used to do organic or paid, you know, method to bring leads into the group and then uh, do our own customer journey thing. But after Go Collab is introduced, we can now let me log into our my this is a demo community, by the way, uh, if we go to settings and if we go to discovery, you can see that you can actually turn this toggle on and then you can make it a part of the Go Collab community. So if you turn it on, it becomes discoverable in the website gocollab.com. So if you search for this, uh, this group will basically appear, but you have to have at least 10 members. So you don't have to worry if you have more than 10 members, then if you just turn it on, this group will be discoverable by anyone. But talking about that, we know that Go Collab is a thing. It has its own phone, uh, you know, mobile app now on Android and iPhones. So if you just go to your app store or play store and type Collab, K-O-L-L-A-B, it shows the app and you can download it. You can uh, share that app with your audience so they can watch the courses. They can interact through your uh, community through the mobile app. So that's all live now. And also Go Collab on the desktop version, as you, as you can see it already is live and you can make your Go High Level community discoverable here from now, from today, right? Uh, from the level up day, Go High Level has had this huge level up where they introduced a lot of features in the level up day. They made a few more, they made a few more uh, upgrades to the community feature, right? So you can have your own events. So if you have a live coaching you, you want to do for your group members and stuff like that, you can do it now. It has its leaderboard. It's it was uh, there previously and members can chat with each other. So if you click on members, uh, if you click on this chat option, you can actually send messages to your to your group members. And if this member already has the app installed, uh, the member gets a push notification in the app. So it's that simple. You, you couldn't actually speak to uh, the members using chat but you can now. And you know, because it's a part of this group is a part of high level. You don't have to have a subdomain. Now, if you make this group discoverable here, it gives you a nice URL, gocollab.com slash your group uh, URL slug, right? So you don't have to have your own subdomain set up and all those, you know, stuff to just host the community. You can now host it in Go Collab. So make it a part of the Go Collab website right and obviously there's the chat functionality there's a leaderboard you can host courses in it lots of stuff to do you know anything cool used to have i think go collab has everything now all that now so if you want to obviously if you have a public group make sure you part, make it a part of the go collab website make it discoverable like by going to settings and discovery and you know turn that toggle on and uh, i hope you best of luck if you are already uh, you know starting to see the potential in it you don't have to school use anymore so you don't have to spend 99 dollars every month it's entirely free for you even if you are not a go high level user majority of my um, viewers are go high level users so it's basically meant to the, meant for them so you're getting the community, you're hosting the community, 
and also you get to do your you know regular customer journey stuff email marketing sms marketing whatever you are you were doing in the past you just keep doing it using high level so i hope this video was helpful and i will see you in the next one Thank you.